Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Main hub mode of Bang on Balls Chronicles. <coughs> so this is unofficial, I don't know exit plan games or anything, but I just wanted to show around since the release date's coming out soon. So, when you first start the game, <coughs> this the gate over here will be closed, so you have to go through here. Which is basically like the tutorial. Do it. You got your makeup room so you could quickly change balls. Like, you could change to different, like, just normal colors, or a country, or whatever this is, I don't know. Tattoos, and, yeah, boy or girl. Then you go into mocap studio, which will show you how to jump and stuff. Then, this room will teach you how to block. This is where you get your first doable item. And it will teach you how to throw it. And if you continue over there, you go to the studio lot button here. teaches you how to zoom. You hold Z to zoom. Get that code. Bob Bob. Okay, now let's continue on to the main studio. So, <clears throat> I completed all the stuff. But this is the first world you would have. I have everything in this world. So I could show you around. So you got the medieval, you got the castle, and the bell. Then over here is the Roman Colosseum, the graveyard, uh, a cave. Oh yeah, you got the beer fort, Viking long sips, Stonehenge, a uh, town, uh, just a normal looking statue, uh, one of those thingies that spin water. I don't know what they're called, a castle, and that's all for this world. Obviously, when you stop the game, you won't have all this, but since I've played the game a lot, I have everything. So, if I'm not mistaken, the next one is... So, you can see that this map split into two. One side's the Soviet Union, one side's the USA. This is the USA side, you know. I don't know what to think of it. <laughs> You got oil over there, which is America style. Then you got the Soviet Union style. You know, rockets and I don't know what that is. Oh, and a little uh, drilling place. Then, up here is one of my favorite parts of the map of these dioramas. The moon. Which is kind of sick. Okay, let's continue on. So, next that you will knock is Kraken's Lost Coins. Oh, lag spike. So, you got that volcano, that, um, uh, mm, I don't know what this is. <laughs> uh, voodoo uh, people place, I guess. You got a nice little fort up here. Followed by a little cave down here to go in. You got people uh, summoning a uh, bottled, bottled sip. And then a spider breakdancing. Spinny wheel, which actually works, which is actually really sick. Look at this. Wow. Uh oh. You got <clears throat> this lemon fort, which is pretty sick. And then my favorite part these little two uh, pirate. Uh, sips battling it out, and I just think it's really sick. I could stay at the it for hours. Then we got a lighthouse. Uh, ow, a uh, flaming head thing. Then we got Sipwreck Island with ghosts. And that's all. And and then you would unlock Time Trouble in Kaiu Island. Now, let's go on to the unlockables. So, if I'm not mistaken, you would have <clears throat> you would have to pay 10,000 blue balls to get in here. But this is what, what is inside of the arcade. So, I, you got bowling. Who doesn't love a nice round of bowling? Let's see. Strike. 
No? Okay, that's a, like, paw, I think. I don't know. Then you got, like, one of those things that, like, you see all the influences hit. You know, the... That. 3000. Nice. Then this is where they move the arcade machines. The... Uh, mega bricks. The super carb banger. And a kick in the balls. And this is where the, um... Uh, a uh, uh, lollipop thing is where you could redeem rewards. So that's one of the two unlockables. The other unlockable is a zoo. As you can see, I'm approaching the zoo. Now, I don't know what the studio is to the right, but I'm guessing it's going to be something big. But this, the zoo, costs like 15,000 blue balls. This is what you get. You know, a nice little moose, I think. No, that's a ball. Um, <laughs> then you got spiders, which is actually sick, because look, they made their own gaming console with their own controllers. <laughs> I love that. Uh, it's saying something, but I have the volume muted, because it's so loud. Then you got this little exhibit with the missing link. Which is a human, or... So I'm guessing the lore of this is that the humans went extinct, and the... Sorry. <laughs> the balls took over. <laughs> I'm sorry. And then you got, uh, mountains. Which are pretty cool, you know? This is what Canada is, I think. I don't know. I don't live in Canada. Then you got this nice little sh tropical resort place. With these, this crab making a cocktail. Get out of here, frog. Then you got this little tube, which I don't know what this does. Yeah, I don't know what that does. But yeah, that's the tour. That's everything in the game pre-launch. Uh, For all you new players, you know, thinking about getting the game, the game is definitely worth it. You could, sp you could definitely spend a long time playing it, especially with um, achievements now in the game. Which, if it loads, I've gotten all of the new ones, all, nearly all of them. As you can see. Now it's pretty obviously how to do it. If you're on PC, it's Q to whistle a fart. Then, yeah. This one, you have to get it while you're in it. This one, you just go to the um, mini game in the thing. A kick in the balls. And then spinner, it's that spinner in the cold race to space. When you're getting one of the USA missions, you, um, you uh, test a rocket engine, and then when you get into the next room and defeat that uh, triangle, you get in one of those spinners that are down below, and then you fart while in it. That's how you do it. So yeah, if you like this video and want to, see, if you like this, then make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye bye. Bob.